Hi, I'm Tim Bartz, Internet Sales Manager here at Law MacArthur Ford in Salina, Kansas, your source for Ford news update and information with a video on the 2024 Ford Mustang. So we do have some information that we can uh, let you guys know about uh, when, in regards to when you know we can actually start ordering the 2024 Mustang, when you can see build and price available, and all that good information on this video. So if you like videos like this, stay like to stay updated on information. Uh, also do good walk arounds. We'll do a, a breakdown of the build and price when it's available as well. That kind of those kind of videos, you'll probably like our channel. Hit the subscribe button down below so you can subscribe to the channel. Hit that notification bell. That way you'll be notified next time of another video uploaded to the channel. So let's dive in here. Now remember the 2024 is the seventh gen Ford Mustang. So all new Ford Mustang, uh, total kind of redesign, uh, of course, exterior, interior, uh, new upgrades to the engines. Uh, we even have uh, the first four or 500 horsepower um, retail factory ordered vehicle called the Dark Horse Edition. Uh, if you haven't had a chance, we did a video with the brand manager at the Chicago Auto Show. So check that video out. I'll have it at the end of this video as part of the, the end scene as a recommended video. So check that video out if you want to watch the uh, full walk around on that edition. Uh, but some great, uh, great new upgrades here and a lot of different options. And so we're going to need all this information so we can make good informed decision for those of you that want to purchase a 2024 Ford uh, Mustang. So I won't go through all the and the new information and what's new and everything. Um, done some videos on that. We'll be doing more of those uh, coming up. But let's get into the the meat of what people are, are wanting to know is when is the building price going to be available? When can we order these? So first, let's talk about the building price. So Ford's uh, goals and objections for timelines is that March 27th will be what they call their phase one for their building price, having the trim levels available there, having the colors available and some of the basic information available on March 27th. Uh, we'll get into order banks and when they're going to open up and how that reflects to that in just a little bit. April 17th, which is Mustang Day. So that is when the Mustang was first introduced back in, uh, was it 65, 64? I mean, uh, so that is a Mustang Day, as we all like to call it. And phase two of the building price will be available. We'll get more trim details. We'll also get full package details as well on that date and what they're calling phase two building price. Later in May, we'll get what they call Phase 2B, where we'll get more images and more details on the different build and price of the vehicles and such. June, they'll finish out Phase 3. So early summer, we'll see the full build and price available with all images and such and everything available. So uh, several different phases. Um, so anyway, so let's talk about when these can be ordered, though, and when the order guides are going to be available. So order guides are what dealers get uh, with information on how things can be ordered. So that is the like the Bible for us in a sense of what can be ordered, how they can be ordered, what the package codes are when we go to put these vehicles, uh, these orders into the Webdo system. And so the, the order system and the price guides will be available February 27th, one week, one week from today. Uh, they're saying they should be available. So actually, I did see one uh, page that actually said the week of the 27th. So if we don't see them, probably end of the business day on the 27th or maybe the 28th when we see that. Uh, we'll be doing some videos on those that week if they do launch. Going over all the different trim levels and how it's trimmed out uh, before we'll probably even see it on Ford's website. And before we can actually order. We'll get into that in just a little bit. Um, so it is really great that Ford is listening to dealers or listening to customers and saying we really need these order guides ahead of time so we can help educate and we know and stay trained on this information so that we can help uh, educate our customers so that we can be like, well, I don't know either, you know, that kind of thing. We've seen that happen and before with, you know, the, the Maverick and some other trims or other vehicles, I should say, and not really knowing, you know, any more than the customer does because they're getting it the same day. So uh, this is great. Thank you, Ford, for, you know, keeping us updated and, and keeping that going and, and always getting better and helping us to do better with our customers. Uh, we will see early build uh, units that are going to be offered in early March. Um, so uh, dealer order banks will open up at saying March 27th. So again, that date could move a little bit, but March 27th is their goal to order to open up the order banks where we can start ordering the Ford Mustangs. So all dealers will get some uh, dealer orders, and we'll talk about that in just a little bit, what that's going to look like, uh, some early allocations and such. Um, also, dealer and customer resources will be, guides will be available as well on the 27th. So uh, dealers have this, what we call an e-source, um, 
e-source guide where they can go in there and get more deep deep dive information than what the order guide is going to give us and that's going to be available on the 27th or at least one phase of it will be available um so there is going to be a second phase that'll be available um or actually i should say february 27th there's going to be uh, there's going to be 60 pages in the e-source guide for dealers should be able to access with some of the descriptions of the 24 model year and order guides and such like that and then in phase two of the e-source information will be available to dealers on the 27th so uh that way additional information pages the changes from 23 to 24 that kind of thing which a lot of changes other than the total redesign so let's talk about the early build program that's going to be available and these are going to be pre-configured um, units uh that's going to meet some early build uh, requirements for ford um probably those early first builds that are going out right uh they're going to be kind of uh, built and then we can uh, are going to be able to get choose some of those builds um to be able to take delivery of those that are already kind of sense pre-made in a sense uh, a lot of times ford does what they call rapid replenishment for dealers that earn those and those are for, uh, vehicles that are kind of, in a sense, already built. And then you can basically just take delivery of those or have them shipped right to your dealership. So a little bit quicker. So um, and then also those are going to be a mix of EcoBoost and GTs and a mix of coupes and convertibles as well. So a full mix of it. Uh, the whole goal behind this is to, to they're going to build these in early spring to arrive in early summer. And, you know, each dealer will get like, you know, each dealer will get at least one. Uh, more of them will go through uh, based on the, the share of the nation sales, which we're really fortunate. We do really well with Ford Mustangs. And so we're probably going to have, we're going to get more than one of those and get several of those here to be able to show our customers uh, where they can come in person. We can have like a Mustang day. They can take a look at these vehicles if they are waiting to, to go ahead and order until they see one in person, maybe even get a chance to drive one, that kind of thing. Now let's talk about... Um, allocations uh for a second so dark horse allocation is going to be every dealer is going to get at least one they are going to be limited run uh on these and uh for this year and uh the remainder of the al uh, of the units will be going out on a on a, again a share of the nation based on that so we'll probably again for us sell a lot of mustangs we're probably going to get more than one we'll probably get two three four who knows how many we'll get but each that's how those are going to be rolled out so they're going to be given in a same sort of allocation system limited and uh, knowing how many they're going to be able to produce and based on the share of nation accordingly to dealers but every dealership will at least get one um 24 production is going to last for 18 months so it's going to start in april of 23 is when production is going to start and it's going to run through september of 24 and then 25 model year will start up in uh after september of 2024 so that's pretty cool uh dealers will receive uh allocation numbers by the end of this week including the dark horse numbers so you will receive all all that information uh they said by friday so uh, a sheet will come out an email will come out to the dealership showing you how much they expect your allocation number to be based on your share of the nation in the past uh, 12 months also what that dark horse number looks like for you so that way you can kind of start planning your allocations your orders if people come to you and want to order you know kind of where you need to stop ordering for at uh, this being an 18 month run i think uh, most dealerships are going to be okay with there and uh but the dark horse will probably be the big one of knowing that there's going to be a lot of demand on that that addition so knowing what that number is going to be for your dealership is very important so you don't end up with more orders for the dark horse than what you can handle and allowing dealerships to find or customers to find other dealerships that they can fulfill their dark horse order with is the, got the goal there so uh anyway some some great information uh, again uh, we're going to be able to it looks like the these are going to be released in early summer so the okay to buy uh did i not get that unlisted anywhere um uh, see okay to buy is early summer um so that's when they're going to start shipping those out so the, those early builds will actually kind of be there um they're going to be in there but they're not going to actually release them out to early summer to for production or for them to be shipped out to the dealerships so that's what okay to buy means it means it's okay for them to go ahead for the dealers to go ahead and sell them and customers to buy them and so that'll happen early summer as well so these will be held they're going to start producing them in april holding them off until uh, early summer for a big release 
for all of them. So uh, anyway, so that's kind of the information I wanted to share with you. Uh, at least now we have some information of, of some dates. Um, so hopefully next week we get the order guides in our hands and we can give you uh, start giving you guys information so you can start planning uh, for that March 27th order guide bank or the order bank uh, opening there for you. So that way you can get your Mustang ordered. If you're really excited about this one, uh, looking forward to get a, your hands on the 24 and want to order one, now you at least have some information that we can go off of and a little information about what you can expect to find on Ford.com as well as with your dealers. So hopefully your dealership uh, will uh, notice this information. You might even keep them updated and deal. hopefully this video helps out dealers as well. So you kind of know too, if you missed the webcast today, when you're going to start being able to get this information in your hands to help share with your customers. So hopefully you did like this. If you did find the video helpful, smash that like button. I really appreciate it. Helps the video out and it gets it out there and lets people know that this is a video they need to see. And if you did like this content, you probably like some of our other content, including a live stream we do every week. In fact, tomorrow night, we're probably going to be talking a little bit about this. Uh, so every uh, Tuesday night, 7 p.m. Central Time on our YouTube channel right here, you can find us live. Uh, so we'll have, of course, we keep you updated on news information, uh, dealer news, scheduling information for different models as well as take your questions live uh, after our topic of the week. So uh, very fun time. So if you want to check that out, make sure you subscribe, make sure you hit that notification bell. That way you can get notified when we go live on Tuesday night, as well as when we have a video go live at any time out of that. So again, thanks for watching this video. Hope you did like it. Don't forget, as I like to say in all my videos, be positive, be kind to one another, be kind to yourself, and we'll see you guys on the next video.